Well, what up, what up, guys? Your boy Jeff here. I am in Los Angeles. I'm at Los Angeles Union Station. This is your main point for travel. If you're traveling through Los Angeles, you can take the subway from here, different trains to different cities. You can even take a lot of buses and the airport flyaway bus connects from here. It's very big, it's very confusing. It's also very beautiful. As you can see. And I'm gonna give you a quick tour, walk through, what to look for, and um, how you can survive Union Station. The food options at Union Station are rather limited. There's a subway. There's a pretzel shop that's closed. And of course, there's Starbucks. So Union Station does not have a whole lot of food options. They do have a Starbucks. I got my coffee right here and closes at midnight and opens up at 3.30 or 4 a.m. depending on the day of the week. I recommend bringing food if you're gonna be doing a lot of traveling, but if you need a quick snack, Starbucks is your go-to. There's ticket windows everywhere in this Metro Customer Service Center behind me, but they don't sell tickets for every train. So you have to ask around and go to the correct kiosk to get the correct ticket for the train that you're riding on. So it can be confusing. Make sure you leave yourself enough time to find out where you're going. And that's what you need to do when you come to Union Station. It's very big, a lot of people coming and going. Um, trains, like I said, not all the trains are the same. There's different trains going all over the place, subway trains, buses going in and out of here. So you need to make sure that you purchase the proper ticket. And the people working here, they don't always know what direction to point you in. So keep that in mind too. You're gonna have to search around because you might ask a worker and they do not have the information for you. So make sure that you keep that in mind because you're gonna have to search around and find the right person who can help you and then on top of that, where you need to go. As you can see, this tunnel that I'm walking through right now is very long. Big place. Easy to get lost, easy to get confused. Although, it is a very beautiful station, especially the area that we just walked through. It does get kind of seedy here at night. You get all kinds of shady characters walking around. So I recommend making your travel plans during the day, if possible, just to avoid all of that craziness. But, um, but yeah, the front room is the most beautiful. The rest of it is just this big, long pathway that you walk through. And then you have your different little areas here where you can catch trains etc 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 but I hope this gives you an idea of what to expect when you get here here I'll show you guys where the restroom is standard public restroom in any major city dirty 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 there was homeless people in here basically using it as their shower when I arrived on this day it was a surprise to me restroom looking occupied though. Amazing. So I'm here early in the morning. It's about 6 a.m. right now. And as you saw, the bathroom was full with homeless people. So guess it doesn't matter what time you're traveling. There's all kinds of craziness going on around here. Mm-hmm. And that's pretty much it, folks. That was my tour of Union Station. Quick, simple, to the point. Just wanted to give you a quick idea of what to expect when you get here. So you kind of have an idea how to get around and what to expect through the madness. Um, not too bad. If you just plan it out, just give yourself enough time. That's the main thing. You don't want to be here um, running really tight on time because that's when you can buy the wrong ticket or get on the wrong train, find the wrong platform, stuff like that. Because like I said, the um, the workers don't always know the correct direction to point you in. There are, 
people that do know, but you have to find the right worker. That's what's up. All right, guys, have a good one. Peace and love until next time. Let's get the party started right about now. I got love.